Hello my internet darlings, uh, Glitch here again. This is another random upload, but this time it actually has um, meaning to it. It's thanks to this guy. I know it's a beautiful shot of Valrak there. Um, yeah, if you're part of the Warhammer community, you will have heard of Voldemort. He's a law YouTuber with the silkiest voice known to mankind. And his channel has been hacked. He's lost access to his YouTube, um, Facebook, everything. Um, it's it's a hacker, as obviously it'll be a hacker. Uh, so they've they've changed his channel to a cryptocurrency scam. So I'll leave a link in the comments below. Which uh, if you could just reshare that on Twitter. Yep, refusing to call it X. It's Twitter. Uh, that would be greatly appreciated, and we can try and get his, his channel back, Voldemort stands. But whilst I'm here, yeah, I have tried setting things up so that I can film, but unfortunately my webcam that I bought, it's um, some fancy £100 one, it really doesn't like close-up stuff, so I was trying to get a shot of this dude, who I have almost finished i'm nearly happy with him but yeah i couldn't do any close-ups on it at all so um yeah it's just going to be phone cam for a while longer <laughs> i do apologize for that uh yeah so that's my beloved little dreadnought i've called him um office baby legs because he's got quite small legs And I'm working on some more of these. I was thinking about doing a video of uh, my the paints that I use for this particular colour scheme. I've gone for a kind of stippling approach, which I think looks kind of nice. Uh, yeah, he's, he's almost finished there. And there's been some more work on my little baby there. Look at him. That is stupidly cute. Uh, yeah, I'm also going to be emailing Games Workshop to say, hey, would, would you like to send me some stuff? Specifically, some Emperor's Children stuff, because these guys are going to be ready to go. I'd like to document me attempting to do Emperor's Children as an army. Um, I was also thinking about doing how there's links between autism and uh, board games in general. And how it's really good for people with ADHD and autism. Uh, yeah, what do you think? Let me know. These videos are, are going to be short and probably quite rubbish for a while. I've just got to remember what I'm doing. But yeah, until then, glitch out.